button on 14. All right, how's it going this morning? Well, today, not too much on the docket. Um, we're actually going to do something a little... Um, I'm going to do some a bit of ex experimentation. Um, let me go here. Oh, no, no, no. Let's go. Let's do this. All right, so we go here. And I actually need to change the title. So, go here. All right. But wish me luck. Uh, today, we're going to be playing some let's play of Final Fantasy A. Yeah, man, I've missed it. You've missed it. We've all missed it, man. It's time for Final Fantasy VIII. So, here we go. All right. I'll just kind of boot it up. And, uh, <laughs> yeah, what I'm most excited for is Triple Triad. Yeah. dun 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 Oh, man. Yes. Alright. I might as well put this on my Twitter and stuff, though. That we were uh, streaming here. You might hear the familiar... Yeah. <laughs> That's the sound of fun. Alright. Now, I don't remember exactly what we were doing in FF8. But, you know... Um, We'll figure it out. We'll figure it out real quick. So. We will figure it out, everyone, boys and girls, people of all ages. Um, yeah, let me just save that over there. Okay. So. Okay. All right. It's a nice. I uh, hope you guys are doing good today. Today is uh yeah November eleventh. 11 11 2023. It's a nice, chilly, just kind of fall morning. Uh, yeah, we had some rain here last night, so it's just, it's just really cold in the morning, and uh, which is kind of good, you know, because, um, yeah, <laughs> um, yeah, it's just, it just feels like fall. It's just nice and just kind of fally, you know what I mean? Nice and chilly. Break out your uh, fries. It's nice and chilly, so, uh, yeah. Anyway, without further ado, let me click into the game here. And, uh, right, press any key. Um, there we go. And, right, let me hit this. And then let me hit the continue key. And, uh, I think last time we had, we, we were like right, we had just arrived in Timber. If I'm not mistaken, uh, right, and we, we, we were just, like, I'm pretty sure I explored the city last time, uh, let me capture, um, now, right, I always forget which one that is on the capture for FF8, let's try this one, uh, FF8.exe, right, I, I'm, I, I'm, like, man, I, I know I've, I talk through this every time, but, um, you know what the nice thing is, is, uh, my cell phone's over there. Let's go to gameplay here, okay, and let's go from there, alright, so let me close this down, okay, and then let's, uh, let's just go in here. Now, I'm not gonna make too many moves in the game. Uh, luckily, we're not, we're not, I think that we are not in a combat phase, um, no, well, actually we are, we are. Because at this point there are random battles, I'm pretty sure. Um, but let's um, go. You know what? There is something I do need to show that I don't think I have yet. So that you can do right now in the city. Um, now I'm pretty sure I already showed how the Alice Tale works last time. But let me go here um, while I do this and like check on the game and stuff. Make sure the audio is working. Let me go here for you guys. Um, also, let's see what our GFs are learning real quick. So let's go to the menu. Okay. Let's go to GF. And I think someone needs to learn boost. Um, Magic plus 40 on Siren. Okay, Diablos. Um, oh, yeah, yeah. He's three away from um, ST. I think that's status magic or fine. Okay. So that's what we want to learn. I'm pretty sure Eifert's done. Yeah. <laughs> so, yeah, GF is fine. Uh, HP. Um, 
a sheep is almost done. Uh, Quetzalcoatl, basically almost done too. Okay, so that's the important one, is we want to learn uh, Status Magic Refined. Then after that, I think we want to learn Encounter None. Uh, well, then again, Mug is pretty, uh, huh. Also, HP Junction would be good, because um, that's on Selfie, right? Uh, yeah, and Selfie's the only one who doesn't have, huh. I don't know which I, which I'll prioritize first, HP Junction or probably I probably will prioritize HP Junction actually, but Mug is just Mug is a one of a kind ability. Only Diablos has Mug. So um, anyway, let's go this way um, and let me grab my phone here because there is something I want to show you guys. So uh, one second. check my uh, stream so if you go here to this area right here there is a chance a guy will appear not that area but right over here um let's see where is it where is it? i think it's over here okay and there is a random battle so there we go yes yeah at this point uh there are still random battles and it's a uh uh what do they call it commander guy yeah so uh, what do they call these guys? Um, I forget. Let's see. Anyway, selfie go. Uh, oh, nice. He's down. All right. One hit. Alrighty. Not too much experience, so that's good. Two AP, we'll take it. Uh, so if there's a soldier, we'll kill like one soldier, but. Uh, now, I think we want to go here. No, 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 no. So, the area I want to get to, we actually saw it to start the... Uh, yeah, maybe it's this way. We we saw it to start this uh, section of the game. No, 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 no. Let's go back. Maybe it's down this way, yeah. Because um, we saw, like, a little cutscene. Yeah, yeah, it's right here, actually. Oh, here we go, here we go. Yeah, because uh, I didn't want to miss any dialogue here. Ah, looks like the trains have stopped running. Usually the local trains will be running here. A lot of hustle and bustle. Yeah, I wanted to get to this cutscene. Um, so there's that. Um, now, let me make sure we're sh we're got, we got audio and stuff. Right, because you remember like, when we first came here and that uh, commander guy was like, you know, we can't take any action. <laughs> He's like, please hear me out to the very end <laughs> pretty funny but if you come here to the section uh while you have Renoa or Quistus in your party and then you leave and then you come back and then just just keep checking here just keep checking here in this section just keep checking it may take you a few times it may take you a few times but okay yeah yeah there's this guy there's this guy so we found him, we found him, we found him. All right. And so if you, you talk to this guy right here, oh, uh, <laughs> battle, so. <laughs> but if you talk to this guy here, um, something will happen if you have Reno. Nah, see, we only need two AP. These guys do give two AP each, so let's go ahead and kill them both. Um, but after this, I'll probably run away from most random battles, so. Anyway, there's Renoa's weapon there. Um, oh, you're right. We have Death Junction. <laughs> so we just we just like inflicted that guy with death, meaning he died. And he died. So a lot of EXP there. Um, a Phoenix down. Nice. Um, we get four AP. Not bad. And yeah, um, levels up. And <laughs> yeah, Zork Baka. <laughs> so with Status Magic Refine, that's good ability. I'll go over that in a minute. Um, and see what new magics we can get. But for now, um, I think Encounter None would be pretty helpful, too. Um, yeah, having no encounters, that may help uh, speed things up for us, actually. So, dang, this is a hard decision. HP Junction, Mug, or Encounter None, like all of them. I want all the abilities. But, you know, let's go ahead and put Encounter None. And I have Encounter Half equipped, right? Let's see, let's check everyone's junction, because it's just been a while since I played, so... 
Um, yeah, that's good. Move fine. Yeah, let's get those hidden uh, draw points. Um, um, okay. And so Selfie must have Diablos. She does. And we do have encounter half, so... Right now we have half the encounters we normally would, which is still quite a lot. Anyway, let's talk to this guy. Uh, 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 hi, Renoa. The, the weather sh sh sure is nice today. Beautiful day, isn't it? Mm -hmm. uh, uh, no, he's thinking to himself. This is in parentheses. But cannot say anything interesting. Such a loser. Darn it, darn it, darn it. Damn it. Damn it. Uh, uh. Uh, oh, he just kind of phased through Squall here. Um, oh, can we move? Oh, we can. We can. Okay. Oh, uh, 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 um, um, please take take this. Bye. I can only assume he's stuttering because obviously this guy has the hots for Renoa. So anyway, it gives us a free potion. So <laughs> there you go. I mean, <laughs> yeah, um, you can uh, keep leaving this area and keep coming back. And basically, you can farm, like, infinite money off that guy. Yeah, it's only potions, but, I mean, there are shops around here where you can sell them. So, uh, if you want to farm infinite money, which I don't know why you'd want to do that, but just potions? <laughs> maybe a, maybe you could do it, do it in some kind of speedrun challenge or something. I don't know. But anyway, <laughs> yeah, yeah. Feel free to just, you know, keep walking back and forth in this area and, like, keep getting potions from that guy. Because um, as long as you have Renoa, uh, he will give you one. See, like, watch, I'll do it again. So, yeah, yeah, see, it, it's almost like the game treats it as if, like, you haven't, you know, done this before. So, yeah, and he'll give you another one. So, yeah, so just, if you want, keep walking back and forth. And, uh, yeah, go for it. <laughs> uh, anyway, we haven't explored this area over here. So, let's go to the weapon shop. Yeah, so, um, yeah, check this out. Um, we already have Squall's upgrades. Um... But this person is new to our party, Renoa. Yeah, so we haven't upgraded her weapon at all. Um, but if you look here, we actually have everything to upgrade her weapon, guys, because we did all those Elden Oil cards. Um, yeah, <laughs> remember when we streamed for like 80 Elden Oil cards? Well, partly this is why. So for uh, Renoa's best weapon, Shooting Star, you need two energy crystals. A force armlet, which we got from X ATM 092, luckily. Uh, one region ring and two windmill. Now, the one item you might not have here is the force armlet, and if you don't, uh, don't worry about it. I mean, the cardinal's virtually easy to make. Uh, you know, just a cockatrice pinion, a mesmerized blade, and sharp spike. All those you we we got from card mod. So, if you need to, yeah, just go with this. It's it's honestly not bad. Um, also, also consider this um we still haven't gotten squall's best weapon um as well yeah think about that we ha and for squall's best weapon we do need two energy crystals so just consider your options um and actually for that reason because we do still need two energy crystals for squall's best weapon i'm actually going to pass on the shooting star for now and we'll just get the cardinal for now that'll give her 79 strength and 107 percent hit or four percent hit and honestly that's pretty good you know that's good enough so let's go with the cardinal also rising sun's pretty easy to make um you know just find some geezer and stuff so uh yeah for now let's just make the cardinal for renoa so there we go new party member already got a weapon upgrade so there you go all right so let me check on something real quick all right All right. Oh, right. I need to, uh, <laughs> my bad, guys. I actually need to change the uh, game category. <laughs> hey, uh, let me, uh, <laughs> I, I knew I was forgetting to do something, man. Let me go here. Yeah, let me go here. <laughs> All right. So click here. All right.
Uh, yeah, that was our main objective, I remember now. So I'm going to put in the title, Mission to the TV Station. Remember, yeah, that because Skull was all like, where's the station? Yeah, so that's our main mission here. So I'll put in the title, Final Fantasy VIII, Mission to TV Station um, in Timber. Yeah, so Timber. There we go. That's a good title. And then here we'll click, um, yeah, category F. I in a right. There's Final Fantasy. There's seven. It's always the first one to come up. There's Final Fantasy eight. Yeah, nice. So we'll click done. And then oh, oh, oh tags. I almost forgot the tags. Okay. So let's put some tags in here. Um, let's get rid of that tag. Let's get rid of um. Hey, we can actually leave the space tag. Yeah, you guys will see why later. Trust me. Um. Get rid of the roses tag, and let's go with um, the t yeah, get rid of the test tag. Yeah, so let's put like final, final, and then fantasy eight for that tag. Fantasy B I I I. Okay, and then let's put um, timber. Yeah, let's put like timber because that's the section of the game we're on. So timber. So. All right, nice little tag there, and we'll leave the rest you know, as, as is. So. All right, stream updated successfully. And one, two, three. Wait a second. I don't think it did. <clears throat> no, it did, it did, it did, okay. Uh, no, it actually didn't want to. It did not add the timber tag, that's interesting. Little arrow on my keyboard there. Timber, timber. There we go, and now we hit done. All right, and so we've updated the stream. Good, okay. So with that being done, let's, um, let's see. Let me back up here. There we go. All right, let me get comfy. Get nice and comfy here. Also, now that I know the audio is good, I'm gonna I'm gonna charge my my phone back up because I need to charge it. So. There we go. Sorry about that. <laughs> All right. Let's see. All right. <laughs> All right. Here we go. Close this. Oh, right. Let me do this too. Yeah, yeah, because I've been doing this a lot lately, too. Just kind of uh, linking the... Because uh, I realize not everybody watches every stream. Or everybody watches every episode. And it's just like, oh, well, what's happening in the game? What's going on? Um, Well, yeah, if I just link here. Which is pretty smart of me, by the way. Since I do put the VODs up and stuff. Uh, for the most part. Um, yeah, we can just ha kind of link the... Uh, right here. <laughs> And go down here, and um, right, we can uh, get rid of this. We can get rid of this. Okay, and get rid of this. And yeah, get rid of this. 
so that's the latest episode I have out, is actually Ronaldo and the Ronaldo as well. Yes, yeah, so... Uh, there you go. <laughs> there you go. And, and, it, and it says the Asuna Jiro Jiro, so... Yeah, I'm assuming, um... <laughs> I'm assuming, like, yeah, we got all those, uh, all that from Jiro Jiro, and then I just kind of explored the town, so. Yeah, that's the latest episode that's out. There you go. So, if you're interested in that, go for it, so. Alright, so. In fact, let me check myself. Let me check myself where we, where we kind of just end, ended things off. I'm pretty sure we kind of explored the town to end the, uh, yeah, we did, we did, we did, yeah. The end, the, and I showed off, like, the, uh, yeah, the... Oh, oh, okay. Oh, right, we showed off that random woman who was talking about Laguna. Yeah, they're at the train station. And I did show off the owls here, so that's important, too. So, all right, good, 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 good. So, all right, that's the latest episode. Yeah, feel free to check that out. And then let's pin this. Yeah, that way, if someone wants to catch up on the series, yeah, you can just go right there and, you know... Go to YouTube, check it out, guys. Yeah, check it out. Yeah, if you wanna, if you even if, even if you wanna go to the beginning of the playlist, you know, you can kind of click in there and then, um, yeah, <laughs> just kind of go to the beginning of the playlist and you know watch F Final Fantasy VIII from the beginning, from the beginning. So, all right, there you go, guys. All right, so there you go. All right, so now now that we've upgraded Renoa, let's go uh, talk to this person. Let's just talk to everybody. Uh, and from now on, I think I will run from random battles. Um, uh, yeah, yeah, I will, I will, because you know we don't want too much experience here. Um, yeah, let's just start to run. Uh, and besides, there are a few required battles, and we don't want Squall over level twenty at this point in the game. Uh, trust me on that. Uh, 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 I'm allergic to cats. My daughter loves them. What am I to do? I heard about you guys. You're going to the TV station? Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am, we are. Oh, that was a secret. I, 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 it's so cute. Uh, her mom just kind of walked off screen there. Some really mean looking guy was looking for you, but are you? Hmm. Good or bad? We're bad people. Good, of course. Good. So I guess you like cats too, right? You <laughs> be. Alright. Oh. <laughs> so cute. Uh, what happens if we say, we're bad people? Oh, so you don't like cats. Like those mean people. They threw a- aww, that's so mean, aww, I don't like to hear that. Aww. Oh, the cat jumped off. Is there like a side mission with that cat? Or, uh, cause that cat well, walked off screen. Um, good people. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So anyway, let's uh, go in here. There's actually someone important, well, kind of somewhat important to talk to. Let's go to the front of the counter here. Oh, Renoa, I'm sorry, y you- can't stay here tonight. Alright. Can't say this out loud, but there are a bunch of roughnecks from Galbadia staying here right now. You know, you it's kind of weird that you said, can't say this out loud, and then followed it up by saying stuff out loud. But anyway, <laughs> that's all, I've always found that a weird turn of phrase, but yeah. <sighs> I understand. Thanks, Miss DeMarco. Oh, so that's who is the hotel owner. Miss DeMarco. So there you go. Um, anyway. Oh, Renoa, how long have we known each other? Call me Francesca. Francesca DeMarco, nice. I'm behind you all the way. Good luck. There you guys go, Francesca DeMarco, so. All right, and um, yeah, as um, he said, um, normally you can heal here, but uh, yeah, yeah, we can't stay here right now. So, Renoa, we're really counting on you to kick some gold body and butt, hell yeah. Um, so, yeah, that's why the, uh, owls here is, um, available at this point. Uh, because, yeah, you can't actually come to the hotel, and you're not allowed to leave the city, so... Um, yeah, now what'll happen if we just walk over here and try to heal? I don't know. Oh, right, the gate'll come down, so... Welcome. Reservations are taken at the counter. Gatey gets... Oh, that's the little kid talking. Gatey gets mad if you go in without paying. <laughs> oh, okay. So, <laughs> there you go. 
Now, if you talk to this person <laughs> while you have Renoa in your party, you actually get some pretty funny dialogue. So let's talk to this la lady here and uh, let's get some really funny dialogue with Renoa. So, ready? Um, oh, oh, oh. Oh. Uh, well, let's talk to her again. Um, hi. This, uh, this model looks really good. Quite some craftsmanship. Don't you think so? Now, if you say yes, like no funny dialogue will happen. But if you have Renoa with you and you say this, something good will happen. Better than Renoa's. Uh, that's so mean. I worked really hard on mine. Yeah, you remember the uh, the segment just a while ago with the uh, how everyone was talking crap on Renoa's train? <laughs> well, this um, kind of kicks back to that. <laughs> just kidding. <laughs> Uh, when someone says they're kidding, it's usually half true. You know, Renoa does make a point here. Like, in every joke, there's usually a half truth. So, uh... <laughs> anyway. <laughs> dot, dot, dot. Squall? What's up, Renoa? Oh, um, it's... Um, just a saying. You know, I'm sorry. Yeah, yeah, and see, there you go, there you go. Uh, now, if we talk to her again... Um, the same person. Uh, I think we'll get some information. Um, uh, and then, don't you think? Yes. My father made it. Yeah, it's so... It's strange to be praised for it. Thanks. So, remember how, um, on the train, there was some talk about how, um... Um, yeah, about the hotel owner and how they were connected to, uh, Renoa's resistance group? And how, um, um someone uh had made like model cars that had started timber or that had something to do with timber well this girl's father is that person you know to that the the expert uh model train kind of aficionado so there you go you know a little bit of uh history on that person that uh, side character right there so anyway let's head to this screen over here and we see some trouble because there's some galbadian soldiers here so obviously it's impending on us the main characters to do something about it so Let's go. <laughs> Better keep your eyes peeled. If you let one resistance member in here, your kids are well. <laughs> Dead meat. <laughs> oh, what an asshole. Alright. Oh, these guys. Oh, these poor guards. Yeah, obviously they can't do anything. We have to get to the TV station fast. Right, that's our mission. I can't bear to watch them suffer like this. Right, well, let's do something about it. <laughs> I, so heard here everyone here supports the resistance you guys are such fools just imagine how much this place would thrive if you were loyal to us this place is gonna be stuck in the backwoods forever <laughs> and you are you happy with your life blindly following orders every day doing things you probably don't believe in uh, so what if we're undeveloped we're not looking to thrive all we want is to be able to stand on our own feet, to be independent, and live according to what we believe. Ha! You guys will probably never understand, having thrown away in your pride and dignity. You're not the fuel fools. Oh no, that's still the secur same security guy. You guys will probably never understand, having thrown away your pride and dignity. We're not the fools, you are. Ha! You're both dead! And now, obviously, we have to intervene here. No! Turn around, fuckers, and face my pinwheel of death that I just upgraded, the Cardinal. So, yeah, this is a required fight. So, yeah, we got to kick these guys' ass. They're obviously messing with the guards. So, you know, what assholes, dude. So, and there was that one down. And now we uh, use Pulse Blade. Oh, I'm surprised that that guy survived that. Anyway, here's the Cardinal. And there we go. That guy's down. All right. So that fight's required. You have to do that fight. Um, you know, if you come this way. So, all right. And we level up for Noah. Two potions. Not bad. Four AP. Okay. So let's talk to these guys now that we've uh, kicked those other guys' asses. Thank you for your help. I got a little carried away there. <sighs> we appreciate your help, but we can't let you through here yeah and this this actually leads out of town right here so kind of weird that they can't let you through but you know i understand the game mechanics like and this happens a lot in final fantasy 8 where you'll come to a new area 
and the game will find an excuse to trap you in that area, especially early on in the game. Yeah, so. Uh, I'm sorry. Uh, it's okay. You know, we understand. Because, like, they did threaten their kids and stuff, so. Uh, be careful. The Garbadian soldiers are all over the place. Things will cool down once Delling finishes business here. Yeah, this guy's got some insight. He's pretty wise, so. Um, let's talk to the other guy, other security guard. Again, I'm sorry, but we can't make any exceptions, Mike. Even if it's a bluff, I can never risk my daughter's life. I'm really sorry. Yeah, I understand that. I understand that. Um, yeah, and, like, that guy could, like, I mean, you know what I mean? Uh, please, we can't let you pass. So, yeah, yeah. That is the way out of town. Um, it's just, you know, we can't really. Uh, we can save in here, though, so let me go ahead and do that. <laughs> you know, we've, we've had glitches happen before in this game. Am I right, guys? Am I right? <laughs> Remember that Eifert Cavern bullshit? Yeah, that, that was fucked up. Anyway, uh, let's go. Uh, oops. Uh, oh, oh, I didn't mean to talk to this person. I was literally just trying to... Uh, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Thanks, miss. Uh, yeah, yeah. Thanks, Francesca DeMarco. So weird. I've never even memorized her full name, but uh, maybe you guys will now. I mean, I, I don't know. Some of these people I never really... Oh, we might as well get a free potion, I guess. But some of these NPCs I never really talk to, <laughs> let's be honest. You know, and it, normally, in a playthrough by myself, it's just that, you know, now that I'm, you know, let's playing this uh, for YouTube, uh, yeah, you kind of want to show, you know, not everything, everything, but, you know, the main, you know, kind of highlight, you know, stuff you wouldn't normally show. Like the, uh, yeah, yeah, and honestly, that part with the girl uh, connecting to, to, uh, yeah, the, um, uh, the the train model uh, person is pretty important. Now, let's see if I have an item here. Because uh, this will tell me if we have went in here or not. But let me see. Let's see here. Do I, ha I do have it. So I think we have been in Timber Station. Uh, one thing I do want to show you guys here in Timber Station. If you go here... I'm pretty sure I already showed it, but there's a hidden draw point right here. Yeah, okay, I did. I did. There's a Blazaga joint draw point right there, believe it or not. So, yeah, I don't remember if I showed that, but yeah. Uh, anyway, let's go. Now, our mission takes us next to... Uh, can we go in this house? Oh, we can. Didn't, didn't know you could go here early. Uh, anyway, let's talk to people here. Uh, they fight a lot, but my parents totally get along. I want to meet a great guy I can scream at and exchange blows with. Um... I need an adult? I am an adult, Gohan. No, no, you are not. <laughs> oh, maybe she... Oh, <laughs> oh, selfie with the little... Inside. You know, normally selfie isn't really uh, comedy-oriented, but um, she's like, maybe she likes... I'm not, you know, Twitch, TOS. I'm not going to read that dialogue. You guys can read it for yourself. Um, yeah. <laughs> okay. <laughs> uh, uh, right, yeah. That's... Uh, <laughs> well, I, I can't believe this dialogue's in the game. Yeah. Uh, wow. Good thing we took Selfie with us, too, and not Zell. Because uh, <laughs> that's pretty interesting dialogue. What? You're walking to the TV station? We have no choice, ma'am. The trains aren't ready. Let's see. There used to be a way through the back alley of this house. Hint, hint, hint. The pub was built around the time they stopped broadcasting. We haven't used the back alley too much since then, so she's telling us where to go, basically. Why don't you look through the second floor window? You should be able to see the back alley. Okay, so she, she's effectively telling us, like, hey, go upstairs and, you know, take a look. So, well, I guess he ain't so nice. Just go talk to him anyway. Oh, what'd he say? Uh, what? What's that supposed to mean? I kind of, like, skipped over her dialogue, but will she say it again? Um, yeah, trains aren't running. Uh, stop broadcasting. Okay, what'd she say here? Uh, why don't you talk to the owner of the pub? Oh, he's scary looking, but... Well, I guess he ain't so nice. Ah, uh, either. Just go talk to him anyway. What? What's that supposed to mean? Oh, I get it. <laughs> That's actually a pretty funny joke by the... Uh, well, you guys will get it later. You guys will get it later. Anyway, there's a cat here, and um, we got two kids. So if we look at the window, uh, look out the window. Okay, so... Uh, it's Qual just kind of so, you know, cue the, uh, you know, Looney Tune sound effect. You know, you just kind of, anyway, that's where we need to go by that safe point. So, right. Yeah. That just looks so weird. All right. And then this little kid's going to say, 
that Tengil please. What? Oh, hey, you at it again? Uh, 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 so apparently this has happened before. <laughs> How many times have I told you not to take money from people? Oh, wow, she, uh, she gave me a little, uh, uh, <laughs> I, 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 I would deuce the price from a thousand gil to a thousand, bro. It, it's not about the money. I didn't raise you this way. Oh, man, mama ain't having no, no nonsense, bro. Anyway, uh, you don't have to pay me. Oh, and he goes back to playing. Okay. Or, okay, okay. Want to take a look? See, go to that window there. <laughs> He's just... You guys ever do that? You do a handstand upside down as a kid? Uh, anyway, uh, let's talk to this person. That's not even our kitty, but it's always sweeping on our bed. Can you believe him? He eats up a lot of our food, too. That's why we're charging a look -see fee. We can't help it. It's the kitty. Oh, I see. They're just trying to feed their cat. I see. Because they're poor, you know. Yeah, you know. It's kind of rough here in Timber. It's kind of rough. So, anyway. All right, let's head out. <laughs> Man, I'm, I'm, I love this game. I love it. Anyway, some pretty interesting dialogue there. Uh, we get got our paycheck. 15,000 gil. Nice. All right, but well, anyway, let's head where we're actually supposed to head to progress the plot. Um, you talk to this girl, too. She always, like, runs whenever you come over here. But then, um, yeah, just, um, yeah, she'll tell you about the history of Timber. I'm pretty sure I've already talked to her, but, um, yeah, laser beams. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, um, you should go to the Aflora, Aflora. That's a weird name. Aflora pub for a drink. I guess Aurora means Aurora at drink cheese. <laughs> I, I wouldn't advise that. Again, TOS stuff, but I understand they're telling a joke there, but uh, what's up? Uh, yeah, it kind of does. Uh, we're on patrol. Oh, we're on patrol. Um, what? <laughs> Are you like warriors or something? You guys watch yourself. So she, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. So she tells you where to go and where the pub is. I think I smell blood. What in the world? Oh, man. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, well, if you smell blood, that means a fight, uh, miss. So we'll, we'll take care of it, ma'am. Don't worry. We're seed. <laughs> that was too easy, man. <laughs> For a country bumpkin, he sure has some good stuff. Yo, better ease off a little. These timber hicks hate us enough as... Oh, am I allowed to say that word? Demonetized. I think we're demonetized. Um, don't worry, guys. It's st story dialogue. Oh, all right. Uh, Minecraft. Minecraft. Huh? Anyway, these two guys notice us. Let's get on. All right. And again, another required fight, so. All right. Right here. All right, pinwheel time. And by the way, if you press the F as soon as, yeah, you hit um, uh, the enemy on Renoa's windmill, I think you have a chance to do a critical uh, hit. You know, just right as the uh, pinwheel slide. Maybe not, maybe that's only with scroll. Like just as the weapon hits, but I like to do it with everybody anyway. <laughs> Press the uh, you know attack command just as it hits them. So uh, anyway, we get the mule card. Interesting. Uh, but don't actually um, like get rid of that card or anything. Um, does anyone need curing? You know what? We're already here at the draw point. Um, let's use some cure on everybody. Um, the there we go. And okay. And then let's, uh, whoops, let's draw, uh, cure on squall. So. All right, we get six. Now this is like the regular shop. So, uh, yeah, yeah. And she, <laughs> this woman just kind of saw it all go down. Um, now one thing I, I almost forgot to do, which I said I was going to do. Yeah. So we learned the ability status. Um, uh, what was that one with Diablo? Let's go to Diablo. So that way I, I can, um, uh, yes, STMAG refine. So we haven't really tried to do anything with that MAG. So this is, um, refined status magic from an item. So if we go here, yeah, we can actually get some bios. Yeah, you can find like antidotes in the bios, breaks, um, from softs. So, and you can buy all these items at the shop, which is why I thought of this. Um, the one thing you might want to do is get like a hundred blinds, you know, for each character. That's honestly pretty good. Um, so let's do that. We got blinds on Renoa, I um, mean, with Squall and Ren um, Selfie. Let's just go ahead and make a hundred blinds for Renoa. So, you know, we're here at the shop. 
we just got paid. Um, that's the one thing you might want to do. So let's buy until we have a hundred eye drops. Um, let's just go all the way up. Okay, there we go. And then, so we go back and we go to status magic. We're fine. We can also check out what else is here. So, but yeah, a hundred blinds for each character. Probably a good idea. Uh, yeah, blind is just a really good spell, you know. And if nothing else, you can put it on your status magic defense to make sure, like, um, you never get blinded. So, you know. There we go, 100 blinds for everybody, pretty good. Uh, silences are also, they can be pretty good, you know, in certain fights. Uh, you can get even get ber berserks, so pretty interesting. Uh, silences, berserks, bios. Let's see if there's, oh, Ochu tentacles are the easiest way to go if you want to do that and not really spend any money, but I, I didn't mind spending the money. Money is really no object in this game. And I did just want to show you guys just how easy it is. Now, confuses is actually a pretty interesting, um, uh, magic to get. I don't think we have Confuse on any character, no. So with the Betrayal Sword, so I don't know where we get Betrayal Swords, maybe from Card Mod, but that's interesting. Also, Meltdowns and Pains. Yeah, this is why Status Magic is really good. So check this out. We can get Meltdowns on every character. So, uh, yeah, with um, one, we'll refine into ten Meltdowns. So let's put it on, um, I think uh, Selfie's the one with Vitality. Vitality Junction. So let's put this on 100 on Selfie, right? And then let's go to the Curse Spikes. Let's give um, lots of pains to Selfie again. <laughs> that just sounds so weird. Yeah, let's... Uh, anyway, let's give this to Renoa as well. Yeah, 100 pains. And this is why I was wanting 30 Curse Spikes earlier and a lot of Mystery Fluids. So, yeah, Pain and Meltdown is like, you gotta have these. So... Really good um, ability they have early on. Um, yeah, we can get more silences from silence powder. That makes sense. So anyway, let's take a look at our new magic that we got. Um, let's also refine these items. I'll look into the betrayal sword thing. Let's see about that real quick. Um, if we go to card mod, what gives us betrayal sword? Um, betrayal sword. I don't know. Betrayal sword. Let's see if I see it for card mod. Um, betrayal. Betrayal sword. Um, let's see, um, betrayal sword, betrayal sword. I thought it was this, but that's mesmerized blade. No, I think betrayal sword is a blitz. I think that's how you get that. Um, also, we can get some more mi windmills. Um, betrayal sword. Um, the betrayal sword. Um, uh, running fire, um, right, and this will give us the pains, the curse spikes, so I'll get a few more, uh, betrayal sword, oh, it's from forbidden, okay, so if you, um, yeah, if you, uh, card refine, let me just show you guys the card, which I don't know if you want confuses or not, but if you want, uh, confuses, you can go to this card, yeah, try to get this card forbidden, which has which is fairly good early on, six and six. And apparently, with the status, now I'm gonna look into um, confusion off screen and just see just how it works in this game, because I'm not sure if we want confuses or not. Um, you know what? Just for fun, um, let's go ahead and take twenty on who's our main magic user. Um, I'd say selfie. Yeah, let's go ahead and take uh, twenty on selfie. And uh, there may actually be some funny dialogue you can get with Confuses, or some funny interaction. So let's go ahead and take that with Selfie, and um, hey, uh, and we'll start Squall on his pains. Oh, trust me, Squall's got more than 50 pains, by the way. You know, it's just, you know, we'll give him 40 for now, because <laughs> we can't give him the full 100. Um, all right, anything else? No, uh, that looks like it. But since we have new magics, yeah, let's check out everyone's junctions, guys. So let's go here and I, I know this is a little boring for some of you but uh uh okay so Renoa does not have vitality the squall the squall have vitality he does okay so let's transfer Renoa's um meltdowns to squall yeah let's do that um oh wait, she doesn't have meltdowns um she has pain and oh okay okay well, anyway let's check uh pain on Renoa let's just see what pain does guys um, on the magic set. Right now it's at 56. Right now it's at 56. Okay. So we go to pain. 
Ah, uh, yes, 76. Look at that jump. Yeah, yeah, pain is one of the best spells you can junction. And also, also, if you put pain over here on your status attack, look at that. 100% the ch chance to cause poison, blindness, and silence. So, also, if you put it on your defenses, uh, yeah, you can boost your defenses by those same things. Now, just for fun, I think we'll take off death for now and put on pain just to show you guys, like, pain is like, man, it's such a good spell. So, uh, anyway, let's check the rest of her junctions. She doesn't have many, but, um, so we got the, but we got the, what, the blinds and the pains, right? So, uh, yeah, so I think Renoa's good. Right. So, yeah, and that's, yeah, pain is, like, really good. So whoever you have status attack on, which I think is Siren's GF. Yeah, you might want to put pain on them first. Now, let's check over here with, um, yeah, let's check the vitality over here with Selfie. Yeah, and she has a new magic. Yeah, look at that. Right now it's at 106, but if you put on Meltdown, 120 uh, vitality at this stage of the game, that's insane. But vitality, uh, Meltdown is probably the best magic you can put on your uh, vitality. So there you go. And then let's check out the pain. So if you put pains on your stream, that yeah, 64 is pretty good. Honestly, also, yes, yeah, 71 on the magic stat is insanely good. And even on spirit, I mean, 74 is not bad. So, you know, yeah, let's have replace Quake. You know, Quake, one of the best magics in the game with pain. Yeah, so uh, there you go. So, yeah, uh, yeah, definitely worth getting um, status, um, what you call it, status um, attack or whatever. So... And then with that, you can even put a uh, quake on your status attack or elemental attack or put it on your elemental defense, you know, to just absorb uh, earth damage. So, yeah, there you go. So, uh, yeah, pain, hell of a spell, as is meltdown. So, there you guys go. So, um, yeah, anyway, let's head inside here. <laughs> Sorry to, you know, take some time up with all that, but... um. Yeah, yeah, necessary, necessary. Yeah, we, because I knew with status magic, I knew we had access to better junctions, so I'm just like, hey, you know, you gotta show that. And a uh, pain is like, yeah, so, <laughs> yeah, guys, be sure to play triple tryout early on like we did, and, you know, get as many curse spikes uh, from the tri faces as possible. Because, uh, yeah, if nothing else, pain alone is worth it. Uh, I've had enough of this city. <laughs> I came from Dollar to have me a good time, and now. <laughs> Trains and loads all with running. Uh, can't even say it to some hotel because of some stupid official. Uh, harassed by gold body and shoulders. Uh, had my precious card stolen. Uh, today has not been my day. Uh, those jerks. Uh, they think they can use brute force to get into thing. Uh, they won't. Hell, uh, am I drunk? Uh, this town's a good example. Yeah. Uh, everything's jacked up because the resistance tried to kid and... Uh, Nap, the president interrupted my alcohol drink. Thanks to them, the trains have stopped. There's gall body and soldiers all over the place. <laughs> all because of them. <laughs> Don't they understand I'm the one suffering from their reckless <laughs> actions? Stupid, boneheaded, good for nothing resistance. You can just kiss my egg. <laughs> you knew Renoa was going to say something there. <laughs> You don't understand anything. The Resistance is fighting for Timber's future. They're all doing the best they can. It's the Galbadian soldiers and the leader who are at fault. Yeah, dude. Yeah, dude. <laughs> anyway, uh, let's talk to everyone in here. This is where we're supposed to go. By the way, what's going on with that Walt, that face on the Walt lion animorph? What the hell is this, man? Look at that. What is going on over there? How to distinguish the drinks? Well, to make it short, Labels are red, green, or yellow. They're either sweet or bitter. Hmm. hmm, you want to know more? Let's see. Red labels are known as Cracker and Mimit. Green labels are known as Tantal and Regan. Yellow are Curial and Silkis. Is that enough for you? Hmm, even more? Sweet ones are Tantal, Curial, and Mimit. Bitter ones are Cracker and Skull. Now, how's that? I don't know much more beyond that. Now, this guy's talking about drinks. So, in order to get this guy to move, you have to give him a drink. But, um... Yeah, so if you hit observe, you basically have to figure out what kind of drink he wants. And if you need to know the exact kind of drink, look it up. But I've never done this. Let's just talk to him, honestly. Um, yeah, um, and um, try to help him out. So, uh, we need to get through. 
Please. And now I'm getting dissed by some punk. Owner, you're Give me another drink. And then, yeah, you can either buy him a drink, tell him about the card. Remember the card we found just outside or do nothing. I've never bought him a drink, so I've always just told him about the card. So let's just tell him about the card. Is this your card? Your children's trading card, sir? Let me show you your card. Is this it? Dark Blade, the Dragon Knight. Is this your card? <laughs> Oh man, I had to pull up a Yu-Gi-Oh card there, guys. Uh, 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 it, it is. Why do you have it? Uh, we found it outside. Uh, are you serious? Uh, mm, okay. Uh, thanks. Know what? I'm feeling generous. Uh, you can keep that card. Uh oh, so he doesn't even want it. And also this one. Uh, I'll move out of the way now. We receive a Tonberry card. Hey, hey uh, owner, I can't stand up. Can you help me? Yeah, and the owner will just kind of, in a weird game mechanic, just kind of slide the guy out of the way, yeah. Because that always glitches whenever it does that, so pretty weird. Anyway, uh, you can get through the back alley through that door. Remember, that's where we're supposed to go. We are kind of lost about what to do about him. Thanks. Not a problem. So, uh, anyway. Um, yeah, speaking of the owner of this pub, we will be coming back to play this, this guy in some triple triad, but we have to wait till a little later in the game. Hi, right, let's talk to you. Scary looking mean owner of the pub did you hear that from his wife yeah so remember the house we went to remember the house we went to before we went in here and she was just like oh yeah uh, yeah <laughs> you know uh he's kind of a mean he's kind of an asshole well that was his wife they're inside the yeah yeah the, the same wife and the daughter's like yeah i want a guy who i can you know you know <laughs> scream and blah blah and selfie's like oh yeah that's kind of weird you know but yeah so the uh, yeah uh, there you go. So, owner's actually a mellow guy. Yeah, he doesn't seem too bad, but not when he's with his wife. They fight like wild and, hey, you know, it, it happens. You know, none of my business, but, you know. Well, you know what they say. The more they fight, the closer they are. Uh, there is that whole thing where, like, you know, like, um, <laughs> and this happens a lot. Like, especially, like, in elementary school where, like, people are like, oh, you have cooties and she has cooties and she's mean and that, 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 she's picking on me, but, like, in actuality, like, like you wait till you get to like junior high or like you're in sixth grade or something, and those same people, like, those well, same girls or like girls that are picking on guys, like those same girls, like, you know, end up, you know, having a crush on them or actually like, if those two ever like make out or something, they actually have like really high like attraction to each other. It's kind of it kind of goes back to an elementary school, you know, kind of clashing, you know, but but it's just like, I don't know, it's kind of weird. But it is like, I don't know, I don't want to say this, it, it, it is true, because you can have a healthy relationship and not, you know, bicker back and forth, but at the same time, I have seen this happen, like IRL, where like, you know, people will really get into it with each other, like, they'll get passionate, they'll get uh, animated, and, you know, it's fine, it's fine, it's just like, that's the way their relationship works, you know, and that's like, you know, whatever, so... Uh, yeah, yeah. So, pretty interesting. I didn't mean to get all philosophical there, but, you know, um, yeah, it kind of reminds me of the old school days, like in elementary, and you're like, you know, that's what they say about elementary school fights. Like, if you're fighting on the school grounds of, like, an elementary school, you know, you probably actually have a crush on that person. So, yeah, sorry to, sorry to blow your minds, kids, but, uh, if you keep picking on that girl, it's because you actually like her, so... Um, oh, look, it's these guys. We, the resistance, carried out the kidnapping of the president and failed. But the president will be dead meat next time. Next time, uh, do you really know what kidnapping is all about? It's like playing tag. Might be said you catch him and then give him a spanking. Well, I guess it's kind of like that. The cookies are ready. Go hand up by yo. Coming, coming. <laughs> yeah, so these kids kind of are taunting us for our failures, which, hey, that's what kids would do in this situation, right? Um, ah. He'll pick hot like too much. Oh, oh dude. Those <laughs> boxes in the corner. They were already there. Oh, I ain't the drunk that bought those here. Uh, others of mine, not those Willie, really, but we before. Wait, what's he talking about? Boxes in the corner? That's weird. Hang on, hang on. Uh, is he telling us to check the boxes in the corner? What's he talking about? Like right here? Oh, no, no, no. I didn't mean to talk to you, dude. I, I want to check those. So is there, is there like a hidden item? 
Like, no way, dude. Because he, he was like, the box is in the corner. In the corner. Like, what? What is, what is he even talking about? Um, Because he said box is in the corner. Weird. Like, I, I've never actually, like, read that part of his dialogue. I'm going to check these boxes. Has it bugged him, maybe? Um, like, huh. Yeah, I've never actually... Huh, maybe... You guys let me know in the comments below. Is there actually, like, a hidden item by this guy? Or is he just, like, so drunk that... He doesn't even realize, you know, what day it is or, or what, what he's talking about. Anyway, um, yeah, that's interesting. I've never, like, really button mashed over here. Maybe there is a hidden item, like, in this corner over here um, that he's, like, literally pointing out to us. Anyway, to the TV station, guys. Uh, don't worry. Um, don't if, if you haven't junctioned up lately, um, don't worry about it. I don't... Yeah, yeah, yeah. You'll be fine. So anyway, let's just head up here and head on up here and we get a lot more dialogue so get ready for some voices by me um here we go so here we go and by the way this tv looks weird by the way okay let me get some more water there we go all right this is creepy what is it this noise is broadcast over most of the frequencies. Oh, Squall has a little insight here. Something has to be done about this before they can broadcast it all over the air. Hmm. All right. right on. Uh, oh, it's Watts. A prison is in the studio now, sir. Too many guards now, so we won't be able to storm play, sir. Uh, so we can't just rush in. Uh, what do you mean, man? We're seed. Special forces, like... Let's just kick their ass. All the ass. Ah, we gotta come up with a new plan now. No, no, no. Let's stick with the same plan. Kick ass. Take names. <laughs> if the president leaves, maybe the guards will be gone too? What are you talking about, Renoa? Let's just storm in there with my gun blade. That's when we do our broadcast. It might not be as influential. That's better than nothing, right? <sighs> Renoa. Renoa, dude. Just send us in. We're seed. We got this, bro. Don't be so flaky. We don't stand a chance if we don't take them head on, right? Uh, don't worry about us. Yeah, Squall. Tell him. Tell her. Tell her. <sighs> She's shaking her head. We'll fight your enemies based on your decision. Yeah, that's exactly what I'm saying. Like, just tell us to just bust in there. Just tell us to bust in there. You know. You're the boss. Tell us, you know, the special forces, the mercenary soldiers, you know, seed, the elite experts of garden. Just tell us to bust in there, man, and, like, we'll kick ass, bro. Yeah. But if you are getting flaky, that's our duty to protect Karakura Town. No, but seriously, though, like, sorry about the Miyaki Akutsuki quote, but, no, like, seriously, though, like, we got this, man, like, but, like, if Renoa's going to be all flaky, like, oh, I don't know if he should storm in, like, oh, the president's in there. Should we actually do this? Like, dude, that kind of, like, undermines the mission. Like, just make a plan and stick with it. Like, you want to kill this guy? Send us in there to kill this guy. You know, Delling's evil. Like, fuck that guy. Hey, I'm a seed. E. Dude, just so you know, I just, just want you to know, I'm ready for anything. Yes, yeah, even selfies like game. Selfie's down to kick some ass, man. So. How sad. <clears throat> sad for you, Kakarot. Look here, you see, Renova. You're not dealing with your average gunblade warrior anymore. Oh my god. Act on my decision. That's your duty. Yeah, dude, you're the boss. We're the mercenary soldiers, garden, elite, special forces, seed. Just tell us to kick ass and whoop ass. It's that simple. Ah, what an easy life. It must easy life. Just to follow orders. Renoa, Renoa. You know what, Renoa? No, no, I'm not having this. Call it what you want. Tell her, Squall, tell her. All we want is to, for you to achieve your goal using our help. Then our mission will be complete. I find it hard to believe. You can do it. Oh, Squall, Squall's hitting below the belt here. He's calling out her, um, her true dedication to the resistance movement. 
Ooh. Uh, what did you say? If you have something to say, just say it. Um, yeah, tell her. No, normally, I'd say, you know, forget it and drop it. But you know what? No, no, no. Squall, let's hammer this point home. <laughs> How serious are you? Really? Oh, oh, oh. oh tell her, Squall. Tell her. The three of you plopped down on the floor to discuss strategy. <laughs> on top of that, you can't make a decision without our input, right? How do you think we feel working for such a pathetic organization? Tell her, Squall. Tell her. Tell her, dog. Uh, um, uh, 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 Squall, he, he, oh, she like kind of whispers here, I guess. Squall, you're being too, a little too hard. Guess I'll, you can either choose to follow it up or just leave it up with that. But no, 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 let's, let's follow it up. Let's follow it up. So, you know, sorry. Guess I got a little carried away. There you go. Uh, 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 what do you mean? I, uh, uh, the, 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 you, you know, maybe this was all a big mistake. Yeah, see, and it's this like, you know, flakiness that I really have never liked in Renoa. Um, but it's just part of her character, you know. I thought everything would work fine once seeds came to help us. But but I guess it's not that easy. Yeah, I mean, yeah, that's kind of what we're telling Renoa here. So it's like, hey, we got no problem storming the place and kicking the ass. All the ass. So just tell us to go and we'll do it. Like, he's there. He's right there in the TV station, the president, the, the mission, the guy. Like, and if we kill the president, Timber's free. Like, I realize it's a tough decision. And like you're worried about us or whatever, but just like stand firm on your decision. If you truly want to be a resistance member, you know, for Timber in the game here, like just stand on whatever, stand on your decision. And the, the mission is just eliminate Delhi because that solves a lot of problems. So, but you can't have like this kind of flakiness in a true resistance movement. I think that's what the game's pointing out here. And I get it that she's young and zoned young and. Watts is kind of young, but yeah, you can't really have that kind of flakiness in this kind of situation. You have to be serious, which is why Squall's like, how serious are you really? Like, that's important. That's important. So you were all hired. It's not like you're one of us. I mean, that's true, but at the same time, you're being flaky, Renoa. So just tell us to go kick ass and we'll kick ass. So, um, let's see. We'll cancel the, yeah, see, that's like, Oh, I hate this part. I hate this part of the game so much because, like, you know, clearly, like, we have GFs. We have power. We have, like, we have authority. We we can kick this guy's ass. And, like, they're like, oh, they're guards. They're guards. And, like, they're talking about, like, regular, like, how many, like, commando guys and, like, regular soldiers have we kicked the ass of? And, like, we beat, like, Elvaret, that giant fucking monster. We can deal with that. We can deal with, let's say there's 75 guards. We can, we can kick their asses. I mean, come on. Anyway. Ah, whatever, Renoa. Whatever. Ah, we don't stand it. I mean, we you, you didn't even try. Renoa. We don't stand a chance if we can take them. You didn't even try. You didn't even try, Renoa. I'm just saying, like, yeah, I realize the the pack's jam-packed with... The place is jam-packed with security. And there is a chance Delling could, like, you know, sneak away. But, like, you didn't even try. You didn't even try it, Renoa. You didn't even try it. So, I've, I've, I've always kind of hated Renoa for, one, not like as in total, you know, there are there are definitely redeeming parts of her character. But like this kind of flakiness right here to start the game, it's just really like, come on, bro, at least try. Maybe we'll try and like just summon Quetzalcoatl and Thunderbolt everybody. Game over. We win. Game over, you know. Let's see if they survive a lightning bolt to the face, you know, so. Ah, so, you guys probably think this is all a game to us. I mean, we know you're serious, Reno. It's just like, we need a leader who means it, you know? That's my issue with, with you, Renoa. Uh, well, it's not. We're serious. Oh, <laughs> yeah, yeah, you're so serious right now. So serious. It hurts. Oh, good line. And Renoa runs off <laughs> just in time for Zell to... Yeah. <laughs> you know, fill up our, uh, you know, recently, um, uh, gone third party member. Anyway, yeah, they thought. So, yeah, anyway. I never have liked Renoa for that part of the game, but anyway. After that, she gets better. Don't worry. Don't worry, guys. 
Renault gets a lot better in this game. So, oh, there's a t technician, guys. Yeah, yeah, like, we can't kick these guys' asses? Like, come on, bro. Uh, testing, testing. One, two, testing. Oh, people, people, people of the world, can you see me? Can you hear me? Oh, this is incredible. Ladies and gentlemen, it is not a recording. This is an actual broadcast over the air. It's been 17 years since a live broadcast has been... That's actually impressive. The fact that the uh, communication satellite got this all going up. Pretty impressive by the Galbadians. I'll admit, yeah. 17 years is a long time. Also, how old is Squall? Huh. If I had to guess, I'd say probably about seven... Anyway, anyway, anyway. Oh, please excuse me. I seem to have lost my composure. Uh, we would like to pr present to you today a message from the lifelong president of Galbadia, Ben Zedeling. All right, here we go, guys. Here we go. Ladies and gentlemen, ladies and gentlemen, President Dowling. Ooh, ooh, wait. What voice should I give this guy? What voice? Ooh, ooh, okay, okay. Um. Hmm. Got it. Got it. Got it. Got it. Okay. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go, guys. <laughs> this is going to be funny. Uh, some of you guys might not remember this guy, but I'm going to give him the voice of President Bush. You know, uh, uh, Junior. Junior. <laughs> my, my fellow Americans. <laughs> You know, uh, you guys, you guys remember, you know, uh, uh, that, that one incident we had a little while ago, you know, Katrina, uh, that, that was a little bad. We, we done sent the FEMA down there. Greetings. I am Ben Zidelli, lifeline president of Galbadia. Today, I stand before you to make the following proposition. <laughs> and like, President Bush always like mispronounced words like that. Like, he wouldn't pronounce proposition like proposition. He'd be like, proposition. <laughs> Like, he'd always make gas at the podium. <laughs> so, so I'm going to mix that in here. <laughs> we, we, we are the people. We, the people of the world, have the power to end all wars. That's right. We, we got to deal with, uh, you know, Saddam Hussein. He, he's, a, he's, 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 a, he's, a, he's a bad hombre, all right? So you see? See, so see? It's a peace proposal to the world. I knew it. <laughs> Unfortun unfortunately, there are some trifle problems standing between Galbadia and other nations, and they must be roads of them all. <laughs> this is so fun. He, I plan to convene with other nations' leaders and immediately, immediately, deeply, deeply to resolve these problems. That's right. At this time, allow me to introduce the ambassador and the ambassador who will be my representative to the conference. Oh, nee. all of this just introducing an ambassador. I, I could have done that. Now, I'm from Brooklyn. We got an ambassador to New York. <laughs> the ambassador. The ambassador is the sorceress. Is the uh, so sorcerer course of The sorcerer. Oh, so that's called the sorceress. Hmm. <laughs> it's so fun reading him in the voice of uh, President Bush. Hey, Cypher. Oh, that was Zell. Yeah, Cypher. Cypher. Yeah, so Cypher's here to... Yeah, what's he doing? Yeah, inspect the trap bait. Stay back. Oh wow, so here we go. Yeah, me squall. What are we gonna do, buddy? You For the last time, stay back. You're only going to provoke him. Uh, nothing. Our job is to assist the owls. The squall's got a point. Our mission has nothing to do with what Cypher's doing here, so Hey Cypher, cut off his head. You know, it just so happened that Renoa was getting all flaky, so... Hey, Cypher. Thanks, man. Hey, do the job for us and just... Just... Shwing. You got him right by the throat, so... Thanks, man. I guess we win. Game over. Nah. <laughs> I'm just kidding. It's not that easy. All right. It's none of our business. Timber Team, are you watching? Oh. Quist is talking to us. The player. Get over here right now. You have permission. I need your help, Timber Team. All right, well, Quistus is calling for her, our help. And can I say no to Quistus if she asks for anything? No, I can't. E squad, squad leader. All right, so up we go. All right, so here we go. Um, and yeah, uh, yeah, yeah, remember how uh, <laughs> Renault was saying, oh, there's guards and all of the, all this. And it, like, look, look from here to the TV station. Do you guys see any guards? Yeah, that's what I thought. Yeah, so anyway, anyway. I guess it's a good thing Renoa held us up in hindsight because uh, uh, let's just see what Cypher's doing in here. You know, and we could have thrown off uh, Cypher's plan. 
you know, plan <laughs> if we had uh, just came in here and kicked ass. But anyway. Oh, I like that transition right there. All right. Oh, I love this music, by the way, too. We need to, like, restrain him. What do you think you're doing? <laughs> oh, right. I have to give him the Kaiba voice. <laughs> ah, Skull, it's obvious, ain't it? What are you planning to do with this guy? <laughs> Say goodbye to those life points. Planning to do. Oh, that's Space Bomb. That's right. Oh, this is Squall's inner mon monologue. That's right. That was Renella. Is that why he's here? Oh, the boyfriend. Trying to help the resistance. I see. I see. Yeah, I get it. Yo, Renella's. <laughs> shut. Yeah, shut your damn mouth, chicken wuss. <laughs> shut up, you pathetic third rate duelist with a fourth rate dick. <laughs> Uh, he, like, broke out of the disciplinary room, like, injuring Minnie in the process. Oh, my God. <laughs> so hot. I mean, what? Yeah, yeah. you stupid idiot, Kaiba. Yeah, you dumbo. Zell, please calm down. Be quiet. Um, yeah, instructor, I know. You gotta take the stupid idiot back to God and shut up no <laughs> Ah, I see. You all from guard. <laughs> Thanks for telling me where you're from. Way to go, Zell. Ah, damn it. Oh man, Zell, you kinda Yeah, your mouth's too bit too bit too much talking for your own good. If anything happened to me, the entire Galwadi military. Well, undoubtedly, Crush Garden. Yeah, we are kind of on a live broadcast, bro. Way to spill the beans, Zell. Damn it. Ah, you can let go of me now. Yep. Ugh, nice killing, chicken wuss. <laughs> now I'll have to make you a fifth rate duelist with a 17th rate ring dick. Yeah, you and your stupid big mouth, Joey Wheeler. I mean, Zell. <laughs> Take care of this mess, instructor and Mr. Leader. Yeah, you see how, like, Cypher's, like, avoiding using, like, direct names? He's he's calling Quistus instructor over and over and Mr. Leader. Yeah, that's why, like, Cypher even was, like, um, you, you know, because Zell was like, oh, yeah, 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 you ever know what's, like, because cause see, he's name dropping. He's name dropping way too much. And, like, that's why Cypher was just like, hey, shut up. Like, you know, even Squall at one point was like, hey, Zell, like, can it, man, can it, you know, we're on an assassination, no names need to be, you know, they don't even need to know where we're from, we're on an assassination mission, just, you know, just KO them, and don't say any names, you know, especially, like, on live TV, that's a bad idea, so, anyway, but it's not Zell's fault, he's a good guy at heart, it's just, he's, he's, he's clearly inexperienced, and this is our first seed mission, so I don't want to be too hard on Zell, but that was a pretty big mistake, you know, to make, um, here at the stage in the game. Now, I do want to look around here. I'm, I'm like going to ferociously press the A button. Because this is one of the few times you can come to this section of the game. My fellow seeds, I have the power to announce that I, Squall, will one day be your leader. And rule over garden. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Anyway, <laughs> imagine if that happened, right? <laughs> imagine if Squall like ruled over garden one day and was like the leader or something. <laughs> <laughs> like that would ever happen, yeah. Hmm. Anyway, I don't think there's anything here. Um, yeah, let's just go over here. And we get some of the best music in the game. Ready? And I'm not going to read too much dialogue. Well, I will, but uh, just listen to this music. Yeah. <laughs> uh, poor, poor boy. Hmm. Uh, stay away from me, woman. Such a confused little boy. Are you going to step forward? Retreat. You have to decide. Stay back. I'm warning you. I have your, your friend here. Oh, and apparently she cast some sort of uh, spell. Oh, and Quistus is uh, like frozen? I, I don't know what happened there. The boy in you is telling you to come. <laughs> The adult in you is telling you to back off. 
No, yeah, let's go with that. Let's go with that. Sorry. You can't make up your mind. You don't know the right answer. Oh, she's trying to mind fuck you, Cypher. She's hey, hey, Cypher, you need a mind condom. Because you're being mind fucked right now, bro. Just 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 off with his head, man. Don't listen to her, man. Don't listen to her. Remember, remember, I know you're not a seed cipher, but kick his ass sea bass. Just off with his head, bro. She's just trying to, you know, mind fuck you, bro. She's trying to trick you. You want help, don't you? You want to be saved from this predicament? No, no, no. Listen here, woman. I've got your president hostage. You want to be saved. Off with his head. You know, that's what you should do. That's what you should say, Cypher. Stand your ground, man. Stand your ground. Shut up. Yeah, tell her, Cypher. Don't be ashamed to ask for help. Besides, you're only a little boy. I, hey, hey, hey. Tell her to shut up, Cypher. Tell, you have the authority here. Tell her to shut up and, like, you're in charge of this situation, bro. Uh, I'm I, I'm not. Stop calling me a boy. I'm not. A, I'm not a boy. I'm forty. I'm a man. I'm Sano Kaiba. I'm the president of Kaiba Corp, and I'm not a boy. Okay, boy. You don't want to be a boy anymore. Hmm. Yeah, she she's mind fucking you, Cipher. She's mind fucking you. I am not a boy. I am not a freaky fish guy. Uh, poor Cipher. Yeah, she's 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 toying with Cipher here. Uh, oh, Cypher, you let him go. Uh, come with me to a place of no return. Bid farewell to your childhood. And Cypher just kind of, what's he even doing here? What the hell? And she uses some more magic to, you know, kind of like, I'm guessing she like freezes us all, you know, somehow. Um, because she is a sorceress, so <laughs> she can clearly do that. So, yeah, like Cypher, eh, I, man, you. I really wish that dialogue was different as well, but uh, whatever. It's part of the game, guys. Hey, guys. Oh, and look what the cat dragged in. All right. Where's Cypher? <laughs> Honestly, we have no idea, Renoa. We have no idea. <laughs> Looks like we got in the TV station. No problem, though. <laughs> it's almost like, you know, Cypher could have used some help. I don't know. Maybe if... You know, hypothetically, someone had ordered us to go in and kick ass. We could have helped Cypher. Eh, you know, we don't know. <sighs> He'll be okay, right? I mean, he would have been okay. Because, like, clearly Cypher was attacking at the same time we were planning to attack. So, yeah, I think, like, if we would have saw him here, you know, Squall and Company... We would have just basically joined in in the ass kicking and helped them. So, and obviously, if here's the other thing, right, guys? And I know I've been hard on Renoa all stream, but if Cipher, Cipher, and clearly Quistus didn't want to help him storm in, right? Because you kind of heard her dialogue already. If Cipher, 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 who's not even a seed, could storm in solo, and he had he had his gunblade to the the three of us. Okay, that's my point. That's my point in this mission. Like, yeah, clearly the problem with this mission from the start, from the beginning, is that Renoa was being way too flaky and nice. You remember remember that part on the timber train where uh, Selfie's just like, oh, we're going to... And then she's like, hey, blow it up with a rocket launcher. You know, the, the train that the President Nelling was on. And then Renoa's like, no, 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 no. That's a little too harsh. It's like, no, no, no. We're mercenaries. We're special forces. We're seed. Like, why are you being flaky? Just let us handle it. Just order us to go and do the mission. Like, that's been the problem from the start. Not like, it's her dedication. And her, like, her being the leader is kind of a leader. is kind of a problem in and of itself. Because she's not qualified. You know what I mean? She's, well, she, and even if she is qualified, she's not making the rational decisions. You know, the tough decisions, the hard decisions. So, and like, like that's my problem with this segment is like, if Cypher can bust in solo, and this is a good point in Final Fantasy VIII, if he can bust in here solo, imagine what Squall, Zell, and Selfie would have done. You know, if, if Cypher can bust in here solo and hold his gun blade to the President Delling, I think Squall can manage to do the same with two fellow seeds. You see, that's my point. And then like, yeah, if she would have just ordered us in at that point of the game, then it would have been Cypher, 
Quistis, who is a former instructor. Yeah, and see, that's the thing is, we, it, it seems like we're only doing the mission with three. No, no, no. We would have actually had four seeds, including uh, Quistis. Quistis, Zell, Squall, and Selfie. I think are more than enough to get the job done. And then basically, we would have just kind of, um, kind of like um, managed Cypher because he's not a seed. But yeah, that's always been my gripe. And plus, like, Renoa would have been fighting too even though she's not a seed, but like, that's always been my biggest gripe with this part of the game is like, yeah, Renoa, she's just a little too flaky and okay. Anyway, and you guys will see why I'm being so hard on her now because her, like her, like back and forth now, her hot and cold nature. Now her, like back and forth, just kind of flakiness. Now her indecisiveness now, Affects like so much later on. So, anyway, facts are facts. Game is game. Story is story. I'm just saying, like, this could have went down a lot. You know, this mission to like assassinate Delling, uh, President Delling, could have went down so much more different if Renoa was just like, okay, just steadfast. Just hey, you guys are special forces. You guys are seed. I order you to get in there and get the job done. You know. That's all I'm saying. I'm going to quit, uh, you know, discussing Renoa because honestly, it's making me a little salty. So I'm just going to read the dialogue from here and we're going to move on. It'll be okay, right? Yeah. And now we all leave the TV station and there we go. Okay. All right. And you're, we can never go back in there in the game. So if we talk to this guy, I'll keep an eye out for you. Go on. You should go back to town. Okay. All right. So... Yeah, we can never, ever, 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 ever go back in there. So, yeah, that's always been my problem with this part of the game. So, anyway, let's just move on, read the dialogue, find a safe point, and get out of here. Huh, they found our base. It's completely... Well, yeah, dude. What did you think was going to happen? Anyway. And everyone else? Uh, They're fine. They're good at escaping. Oh, so uh, Watts is okay, right? In zone? That's good. As well as the other, like the tra train drivers and stuff. All right, so Quistus is uh, part of the party now, as well as uh, Zell. So, yeah, we kind of need to, uh, yeah. Now that now that everything's gone like to shit, what do we do? That's the question, right? And it didn't have to be this way. We could have like succeeded in the mission. We have to stay away from. Yeah, yeah. I mean, that's God, Renoa. Oh. Oh, man. Anyway, let's just move on. Let's move on. Is there a safe place where you can take me? Oh, now you're... <sighs> Face palm. This is an order. An order for... Oh. <sighs> now you want to make the order Renoa. Now you want to make an order? Okay, whatever. Whatever, Renoa. Whatever. Hmm. All right. All right. What are you jumping up and down for and getting giddy for? You, f mm. oh, Amy. Anyway, let's just move on. Let's move on. I'm not gonna get salty at Renoa right now. I'm not. Okay. Anyway, you can get us cans here for some reason now. But anyway, that draw point wasn't here before. Yeah, let's just save here. And you know what? Let's just ride this timber segment out. I know it's been a long stream already. Let's just let's just go and just you know let's just push through and in like in this you know segment of the game because i i just to be honest guys i just really 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 want to get out of here so uh anyway if we go here at uh, renoa i heard your base is in serious trouble yeah we recognize this lady uh come over to my place until things settle down okay so there you go safe place i appreciate it thank you what are you waiting for squall like come on oh my god all right so yeah, the game's clearly taking us out of timber. Well, not out of timber, but to a safe spot right now. So, let's just follow them. And, yeah, we remember where her place is because we've, we've already visited it, 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 it. This way! Yeah, so, the, like, just follow Renoa in this segment. You know, it's still early in the game. This is it. Yeah, so, you don't really have to, you know, even know which house you're supposed to go to. So, uh, I'll let you know if anything changes. Till then, make yourself at home. Okay, thanks. Thanks, Chief. Chief. Oh, oh yeah 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 skull saying okay yeah yeah uh she's the leader of the forest foxes oh 
Almost everyone's a... Uh, wait, what? Almost everyone is a resistance member in this town. Well, dude, Renoa, no, no, no. You don't make, like, 25 different, you know, resistance factions. No, no, no. You make one giant resistance, like, un unified faction. And then you just kick all the ass, dude. No wonder you guys haven't, you know, uh, you know, freed yourself from Galbadian uh, power. Also, 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 I do want to point out, Galbadia has is freaking huge. Like, their army and size and forces and, like, power is clearly pretty huge. I mean, think about everything that happens in this game if you've played this game before. Yeah, Galbadia is insane. There's a reason, like, Timber is uh, struggling right now, you know, so. Uh, but right now, we're the only ones that are really active. Okay. Uh, let's stay here for yeah 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 you know, we don't really have a choice for Noah anyway I guess the flash of light indicates time has passed by I still don't get it uh, what do you mean selfie what did Cipher come here for oh right yeah we kind of already have figured it out but anyway I think he came to help us Forest House right right it's just he came to do it without any communication which. Yeah, that's kind of on Cypher, but anyway. I talked about it a lot with him. Right, okay, here we go. So please, don't think too badly. No, I I don't think badly of him. It's just like, hey, Cypher, you had him dead to rights. You know, the President Delling? Yeah, you had him dead to rights. Just finish the mission. Don't 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 let that, <laughs> that one sorceress, you know, make you need a mind condom. Because she was truly, clearly trying to mind fuck you, bro. By the way, demonetized, but yeah. That's the only problem I have with Cypher is like, he got so close, but he didn't finish the job. Anybody in here? Well, what is this? I have two small children in here. Don't do anything to frighten them. Ah, oh, wait, wait, tell them, Mom. And Zell is clearly like in this scene. Yeah, you see how Zell's just kind of in the corner and just kind of, yeah, Zell clearly knows he uh, had a diarrhea of the mouth there. But uh, it's okay. Zell's a good guy. You guys will see. It's just, you know, he's young. Squall's young. I mean, Selfie, this is their first seed mission. They're all teenagers. Like, yeah, I mean, don't be too hard on Zell. And don't be too hard on Renoa either. Because clearly, like, every character has flaws. And even Renoa is like a teenage, you know, resistance member. So she's not supposed to be a perfect leader. But, you know, she... This could have went down a lot differently. And, like, that's my main point. Upstairs, hurry. All right, so we got to go upstairs and hide from, you know, the inspection. Will she be okay? <laughs> oh, this part's really funny. She'll be fine. The legend goes that my mother took down many soldiers with her strength, cooking, and beauty. <laughs> Listen to this line from Selfie. <laughs> that beauty part sure made it sound like a legend. <laughs> Damn, so. <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> oh, man. Well, that's like Selfie's best line in the entire game. Oh, man. Anyway, let's uh, just talk to everyone up here. Let's talk to Zell. Hey, Zell. Oh, yeah, he's feeling it. He's he's just, man, he's so upset with himself. Uh, let's talk to Selfie. Let's talk to Selfie. Um, <sighs> so tired. Yeah, I mean, we have just been. It's been nonstop action, Selfie. I understand. Uh yeah. Uh, so Selfie doesn't want to talk anymore. She's just kind of laying on the bed. How's it booked up? Uh, do we want to talk to Renoa? I guess so. I wonder if he'll be all right. Uh, oh, uh, died. Sure, he's. Uh, well, he did try to uh, assassinate President. You know, I don't know. I don't know, Renoa. Um, that's just cheer her up. I don't know. Yeah. Um, well, I guess we need to leave to fix this scene. What do we, what do we need to do here? Oh, we can't leave. Oh, I guess I got to talk to Quizzes. Oh, yeah, let me just uh, walk over here. Uh, he was, like, so angry when he found out only the three of you were dispatched to, like, Timber. What? They might, like, end up, like, fighting, like, the whole Gaul body and force. Oh, my God. All they did is, like, dispatch, like, three, like, rookie seed, like, members. Damn it. I'm going to, like, Timber. That's what Cypher said. That's what Cypher sounds like. I never, like, would have guessed he was so serious. Oh, okay, Quistus. I mean, this guy slashed open my, like, face in the opening scene of the game. Not to mention, like, Quistus clearly knows, like, how the relationship between Cypher and Squall is. And, like, you should know, like, he's, he's serious about everything. If he says something, he's serious about it. So, 
Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Okay, okay. Squall and I are on the same page here. But anyway, anyway, so... Yeah, so I don't know how he even broke out of the disciplinary room, but whatever. Uh, I guess let's talk to Z uh, the selfie. What are we supposed to do here? So that's tired. Uh, yeah. Oh, the kitty. Oh, oh, the kitty jumped. Home. Okay. Um. All right. <laughs> uh, tired. Uh, let's talk to Renoa. Wonder if he's all right. Yeah. Um. Zell. Oh, Zell's still like just kind of. I guess we talked to Quizzes again. Oh, okay. <laughs> Gee, I hate it when the scene makes us do that. What's like gonna happen to like Cipher? I mean, well, you know, logically, you know, if someone tries to assassinate a president and they fail, it's probably gonna be off with their head, you know, execution, no bueno. So, I'm gonna say Cipher's gonna die. Yeah, I mean, it's a sad reality, but, <laughs> you know, it's just like, that's like even true for life. Like, let's say somebody like, was trying to kill you and you like you know survived and you know um you know logically most people say oh call the police right <laughs> no, no no it's just like if someone wants you dead what's the best solution you kill them first so and that happens more often than you think you know yeah so you know president or not like hey if i if i knew one person out here like in the world, who wanted me and my family dead, and they and they clearly like, you know, got got it together and started like, and they literally held a knife to my throat. What would I do? Would I call the police? Maybe. It depends on the situation, but especially if I'm defending myself, like yeah, that's self defense. And like, let's say, you know, they get they get out, they they make it out on bail or something. What would I do? Like, nah, I would prepare myself. I'd prepare myself to mentally like, hey, if they come back again, I will kill them. You know, just to just to defend myself and my family. Like, that's yeah. So Yeah, what's gonna happen to Cypher? I don't know. Yeah, yeah. And that's like an old turn of phrase, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. Kill or be killed. Like, yeah. You know, the uh live by the sword, die by the sword. Exactly. That, that's kind of what we're talking about here. Yeah, he may already be dead. Yeah, exactly, Squall. Like, logically, he's probably cadaverific, you know, so. Uh, how can you be so casual? I feel, uh, sorry for him. Renoa, Renoa, baby. Renoa, Renoa, Renoa. Get real. Reality. He tried to do a serious thing. He tried to assassinate President Delling, and he failed. So, he's probably dead. Or he's being like, He's in Guantanamo Bay. <laughs> like, like you know what I mean? If he's not dead, he's being tortured and, like, yeah, like, electrocuted, strung up. Like, he's, like, being hung up and, like, getting a taser to his entire body. And they're like, who do you work for? You know, where are you from? You know, they're trying to get out the information that he's from Garden, you know, or whatever. So, yeah, feel, feel, feel sorry. Cypher would hate to hear that. Yeah, yeah, it's cool. I'll tell him. What's so funny? You're terrible. No, no, Squall's just like, you know, a realist. So, why do you think Cypher... Come on, Selfie. Why do you think Cypher may already be... It's obvious, Selfie. He tried to assassinate the president. You know, that's... Yeah, and we know how much of a asshole dictator Delling is. We read the Anarchist Monthly. Like, we know. Like, we even heard the story from um, that one guy who was driving the train... We heard the story of what they did to Zone and Watts' dad. We heard the story. This guy's not fucking around, Delhi. He's not fucking around. Because the pre the president of Galbadia and the sorceress joined forces. Yeah, exactly. That too, yeah. Cypher attacked the president. It's no surprise that Cypher may have been killed. Yeah, dude, that's just like... That's like a normal logical conclusion. Uh, even so, I hope. Oh, Renoa. Renoa. He's dead. Probably. <laughs> Think what you want. Yeah, exactly, Squall. Like, life is a harsh reality. So. Yeah, yeah. Reality isn't so kind. Everything doesn't work out the way you want it to. That's why. Yeah, exactly, Squall. Tell her, tell her, tell her. As long as you don't get your hopes up, you can take anything. 
you feel less pain. Hmm. So this is just Squall's philosophy here. He, Squall's a realist, and quite frankly, so am I. I kind of identify with Squall in this in the scene. He's the leader, and like he's the only one speaking logically here. Because like, yeah, you can hope and hope and hope and hope, but you can't always get what you want. But if you try sometime or another, you get what you need. So yeah. Anyways, whatever wish you have is none of my business. Tell her, Squall. Tell her. You're mean. Meanie. <laughs> like, you're not making any sense, Renoa. Think about it logically. Logically. He's on, not only that, Cypher is on camera. He's on camera. There's clear evidence of what he tried to do. He's probably dead. You know? Because <laughs> why would they not kill him? Unless, you know, Guantanamo Bay, which I, I get that too. What's with her? Sorry. <laughs> Whatever. I wouldn't even apologize there, Squall. Fuck that. Look how body and forces are withdrawing. Only sword soldiers normally station was... Oh, thank God. Thank God. Let's get the fuck out of here. Out of this city, out of this town, out of this mission. If you're going to leave town, now just... Hey, let's do it, baby. You know how persistent those soldiers can be. Let's do it, baby. Let's, let's move on out. Let's fly out of here, so... All right. Sorry, Zell. Ah... See you, Renoa. Whatever, man. Like, I, I really, like, I really hate Renoa's character. In the, it, it, not, not as a whole, just in this particular segment. She's just, ah, oh, man. Anyway, uh, let's talk to Zell. Oh, man, he's really feeling it. He's just dot, 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 and he, he's upset with himself. I want to go home. Me too, Selfie. All right, let's, uh, okay. Even Renoa's dot, dot, dotting at this point. Well, the reality that Cypher may be dead is quickly settling in on her. Anyway, let's talk to uh, this person. So, what's your plan? Uh, yeah, that's a good question. Uh, what are we going to do? Yeah, so I guess we talked to Quistus here once again. You know, the uh, instructor. Oh, I'm sorry, the uh, former instructor. But, uh, yeah, she has the most experience here. So, uh, seems like everyone's, like, like tired. <laughs> Uh, oh, what do, I, what do I need to do here? Do I need to leave to trigger a cutscene? Um, I, I was, that's cool. I like, any thoughts on where to go? I hate that. I hate that in a video game where you, <laughs> like, to, to, to progress the game, you have to leave. Yeah, typical RPG. Uh, we have to get out of here first. Yeah, true, Squall, true. Getting out of here is, like, only, like, the first step. Come on, Squall. Get it together. Hmm. Hmm. What do you mean? Uh, Garden Code's, like, article, like, eight, line seven. Oh, oh, <laughs> Quizzes is quoting, like, the, the Garden, like, Bible or whatever. Okay, 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 Squall, access your inner matrix. <laughs> article eight, dash seven. Yeah, it's even, like, in the, that's, like, the format for a verse of the Bible. That's funny. That's good comedy. Eight, seven. Uh, in the event that returning to the assigned garden is not possible, report to the nearest garden. Huh. I guess that does make sense. Uh, head for the nearest garden. Very good. From here, that would be Galvania. Gal oh, what? No, 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 no. Wait, 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 wait. Pump the brakes. Pause the phone. Pause the game. Wait, 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 wait. No, 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 no. Quizzes, quizzes, quizzes. I have a problem with you, too. So, let, let's go over the facts. Tried to assassinate president. Failed. You know, on train. Tried to assassinate president again. Have evidence of, like... Cypher on camera failed, had him had him dead to rights. Uh, also, let's uh, let I kind of glanced over this, but frozen by sorceress, frozen, and she froze like four, you know, assassins at once, you know, professional seed members. I don't know how powerful that so sorceress is. She's aligned with President Nellan, and you want to head to their garden? Are you fucking insane? We'd be safer just heading into a random forest and just hunkering down. You know what I mean? Like, we'd be safer, we'd be safer, Quistus, going to a forest, building a boat from scratch, and then just trying to, to sail the sea back to our garden, Balam. Head to the nearest garden, Galbadia Garden? You want to head to the garden, and I'm just assuming Delling has control over Galbadia Garden, because it's in Galbadia. Like, are you kidding? You're dumb. Are you insane? What if the president knows, if the president knows even one person at the school, the minute we show up, 
he he could get on the phone with them or whatever or, or however people communicate in this universe and just say, hey, the people you want dead are here. Come get them. That's dumb. That's dumb. You're dumb. Uh, we can take the train from here and get off at a station called East Academy. <laughs> okay, whatever. From there, we have to go through the forest west of... Yeah, and like, honestly, we should just stay in that forest. Like, the best thing to do when you're on the run is just literally go into the middle of the woods and like camp and hunker down, you know, until you, you come up with a good plan of action and not go into like... Anyway, anyway. Galbadia Garden? Stupid idea. Stupid idea, Quistus. Like, I know that's the garden code, but think about the situation here. We tried to assassinate the president of Galbadia. Now let's head to his garden, you know. Or or let, let, let's head somewhere, you know, public. That's a school. That's nearby. That's like... Like, this is just dumb. That's just, that, that's just dumb. That's just dumb, so... Uh, I've been there several times. We should be okay. I mean, I mean, like, if anything in this mission, if anything, Quistus, you were live on TV too. So let's just think about Quistus' situation here. She was live on TV with Cypher when Cypher tried to assassinate the pre So if anything, Quistus is like a high value target all through Galbadia, all through the region. So if nothing else, Quistus should want to stay out of the public eye. To protect herself. You know, and she's a teacher. She's an instructor. She should know, like... Like, yeah, that's technically... the No, no, no. But the best solution, like I said, head to the head to a dense forest and just camp and hunker down and just... You know, I don't know. That's dumb. Galbadia Garden? Terrible plan. Terrible plan. Anyway. Uh, whatever. <laughs> okay, okay, then. We'll escape from Timber and head to Galbadia Garden. Stupid idea. Stupid idea. I'm just telling you, like, even, like, as a kid, I realized how logically stupid this is because, like, it doesn't make any sense. It really, like, and I understand that's garden code, you know, but, like, at some point, you have to, like, override your default response and, like, just think, like, okay, there's a chance the president of Galbadia could have at least one contact with one random person in Galbadia Garden. This isn't a good idea, and really, all of us should stay out of the public eye for as long as we can, you know. And yeah, just take your time, camp out in the forest, survive on wild animals, and then just build a boat, of like a strong vessel, back to Galbadia. Or just like wait long enough to where they think we've probably logically escaped, you know, and catch the train back. It's like, this is, this plan is just dumb. Just like hunkering down for like, in a forest for like nine months, ten months, a year, two years, makes more sense than this plan. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. Uh, the party will be now. You don't really have to worry too much about the party here. So, I guess let's just take. Um, we already have Renoa Junction. So, what? I, no, you know. You know what? These two are lowest levels. So, let's put um, Zell and um, Quistus here, and let's just go ahead and Junction Exchange while I'm thinking of it. Um, Quistus, let's junction exchange with Renoa and sell with, um, uh, yeah, uh, uh, selfie with Zell. So we'll take the lowest party members, but yeah, this plan is just dumb. It's just dumb. I realize that's garden code, but like, no, let's go. Anyway, you be careful now. Take this with you. Oh, and she, this lady is going to, out of her generosity, is going to give us a potion, a phoenix down, a soft, an antidote, and a remedy. Very good, very good. Thank you all for your help. So, we're counting on you. Good luck. Hey, thanks, man. I mean, we're going to need it with, like, a leader like, you know, Renoa. So, come by our house anytime you're in temper. Also, Quistus isn't making the best rational decisions here either, even though she has the most experience. So, going to Galbadia Garden, you'll have to go through the forest. Get off the train. You can go, yeah, so it's telling you, like, where to go. So, I doubt you'll be walking, but if you do, follow the road at the fork. Take the road on the right. You'll eventually come across East Academy Station. So there you go. So there you go. All right, let's get out of here. Oh, a Galbadian soldier. Let's kick his ass. What's up? Eh, not good. Oh, let me just stand over here. <laughs> and everybody comes on screen ready to fight. It, 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 it's, sir, it's me, sir. It's me. Sir? It's sir. Oh, it's Watts. Uh, uh, got some info, sir. Temper station will be shut down temporarily. Oh, okay. Gotcha, Watts. Mega bummer. <laughs> Not necessarily, sir. 
It's not completely shut down yet. Lane, last train out of here is bound for East Academy, sir. Okay. We are getting on that train. We're going too, right, right, Manoa? Yeah. What about you, Watts? Um, don't need to worry about me. I'll go gather more info. Yeah, and like, Watts is clearly like undercover here you see i also like watts's plan of action like why don't we like because you know we've like been kicking so much ass why don't we all like kick all the ass and then steal five uniforms and just walk around that's genius like look at what what's watts is doing why don't we just all do what watts is copy watts kick ass steal uniforms yeah <laughs> and then since we're wearing uniforms we can say hey the president ordered us to guard Balam, you know, trains to Balam, but he wanted us to go to Balam and then like, you know, stand guard by the, by, by the train station there to prevent entry from that side. Genius. Like, and who would doubt that? Like what, 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 what like vanilla soldier would be like, uh, these people are a little suspicious. Maybe I shouldn't let them on the train. No, no, no. We do what Watts is doing. We steal a uniform, right? <laughs> we like, we say, hey, we were ordered to go back to Bala on the train. There we go. And we just go back home. Like. Yes, yeah, so you see, you see how like logical that plan is and how easy it would be. Like I said, there's more than one way to go about it. And like, I wish like Quistus would have thought of this idea. The minute she saw Watson in uniform, like, hey, why don't we all, like, beat up, you know, five guards, get in uniform, say, like, hey, the president ordered us to go back to Balam and guard guard the entry point from that side. So, or, or to uh, to spy. He ordered us to go to, you know, Balam Station to spy and keep an eye on, you know, these, uh, because the, the, they do have a garden over there and it's nearby, so, and we don't know which garden, you know, ordered the, yeah, which, which one ordered the hit. So... Let's just keep an eye on them. You see what I mean? Easy, easy. I'll go get them more info, sir. All right, see you, Watts. I I'll promise I'll be back. You take care, okay? Aw. And this is kind of an a goodbye for Renault and Watts, so I like Watts. I like Watts. He's always respectful and with the sir, so. Anyway, Squall, please take care of Renault. Um, oh, um, I don't think it matters which one we say, but let's just say you be careful, too. Yeah, don't worry. Client's worry. <laughs> I, I like how we said... Um, you take care too, but as Squall's just like, yeah, client's orders, you know. What about you? Will you be safe here? Aw, there you go, Squall. I'll be fine, sir. I'll be put up the fight of my life, sir. See you, Watts. Aw, and we all just kind of, okay. Salute. Little salute to Watts. See you, Watts. Good luck. I'm happy, sir. Aw, see you, Watts. Take care, buddy. All right, so now we all uh, continue to head out, so just follow Renoa. Nice little bit of dialogue. Uh, Mystery Man. Oh, it's Mystery Man. Another, you know, master of disguise. Uh, Renoa, Squall, it's me. Zone! Yeah, yeah, see, so these guys are really good at getting away. Like, look at these, look, these disguise. Yeah, you need to go to East Academy, right? There's no more tickets left. Super duper mega bummer. Oh, selfie's like second best line. <laughs> All right. We'll do whatever it takes to get on that train, even if it involves ass kicking all the ass. I love I love Squall's attitude here. <coughs> you won't have to do that. Oh, you got a plan, Zone? Looky here. I have everyone's ticket right here. Oh, thanks, Zone. You're the best. Um. Okay, so one for Renoa. Yep, the boss. I guess he's got one for himself. Uh, three for you seeds, people. Here, I'll give them to the leader. All right, Zone, thanks. And the last one's for me. Uh, what about Quist? All right, yeah, Quistus wasn't on the mission from us from the beginning, so yeah, guess you're stuck here, Quistus. Good luck. Um, uh, Zone, what you uh, what you doing? You gotta come with us, Zone. Go on, take it. Oh, oh, Zone. I I can't like take that. That's yours. Oh my god. Oh zone. Ouch. Oh, he's getting his stomach cramps. Oh man. Oh, he just hands it over. Oh zone. Oh my stomach. It hurts. Zone. That's so nice of you, man. Ouch. The train's just going. Just ouch. Just get going. The train's leaving. Zone. 
thank you. Yeah, oh, that, like, zone, that's a big, like, that's one of the biggest gestures of kindness. Like, zone, that's, like, you're the man, man. Zone's the man. Man, and, like, without him doing that, like, Quissus, probably a good chance she's going to get trapped in the city and die. You know, like I said, she she's a high-value target as well, as well as Cypher, so. Zone, that, that's awesome, bro. That's awesome. Aw, Zone. Aw, we're gonna see each other again, okay? Ooh, you know, you know, whenever that's said in a video game or a movie, it's usually not good. Uh, no matter what, you have to survive. We're gonna liberate Timber together, right? Uh, yeah, you know, you know, you know, uh, Renoa, we wouldn't have to liberate Timber if, you know, your boyfriend just, you know, went off with his head, or you ordered us to do what we needed to do. Anyway, so, sorry, sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Renoa. I don't hate you. I hate your inconsistencies. <laughs> um, I know, I know. I'll go hide in the back. <laughs> yeah, this game does have, like, moments of comedy and levity, and I love it. Now get going. All right, Zone. Man, that's a big gesture of you, dude. dude though, I, I Thank you. Thank you, Zone. I, Zone, like, uh, you know, at first I kind of thought Zone was weird with his stomach problems and stuff, but, like, after this moment, I, I have, like, a really high level of respect for Zone. And, um, and, and Watts, too, you know. So, anyway, here's the train. So, let's just, um, let's head to the save point And let's, let's just GTFO, man. Let's get out of here, man. Because I'm just ready to just be just completely done with the uh, Timber segment, segment. So, but, um, I would hate to lose all the progress on the reading of dialogue. So, let's save out of an abundance of caution. And, uh, yeah, we could go in here and heal, I guess, before we leave. Because it's right by the Alice tier, so. Uh, let's talk to this uh, man here. Use the Alice tier. Uh, yeah, yeah. Let's drink all you want from the faucet. And then, yeah. here we go. Let's use the Alice tier and recover. Because we did switch junctions, so. Vitalized. So, there we go. And now everyone should be healed. Yeah, okay. So, anyway, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm surprised these two didn't hear, like, and she's watching TV, like, I'm surprised, like, after the, um, <laughs> after the events at the Timber Station, like, um, she doesn't say, like, oh, hey, I saw you guys on TV, so, uh, poor sister, <laughs> it's her 15th time, that's, that's some bad luck, oh, man, yeah, that's, uh, anyway, uh, uh, oh, mom's working at the pub, oh, grandma to get, oh, interesting, right, <laughs> Yeah, so interesting dialogue. Big, huge room to myself. One of these days, I'm going to get a hey, good luck. Same here. Same here. You know, I'm going to get my own place to stream. You know, people often mistake this for the station office. It's really annoying. Oh, uh, oh okay. <laughs> but yeah, I'm surprised like this person who like is constantly um, watching TV right here, clearly, or watching a movie, uh, doesn't say like, oh, hey, I saw you guys on TV, by the way. Uh, uh, that's that's not good, you know. <laughs> you made a mess of things or whatever, you know. Uh, anyway, let's just um, head on out of here, and um, I think we need to head over here. Yeah, to this side uh, where the train is. So, yeah, with that, let's just head out of Timber, and we're done with this place, man. We're done. Yeah, her Dalit stopping at East Academy. Hurry on board. Uh, get on. Let's just let's just get out of here, man. Let me double check. Get off at East Academy. Go through the forest west of the station. Go body garden. Yeah, indeed. Glad we have a leader with like a good like memory. Oh my god. <laughs> Alright guys, let's GTFO and we're finally, 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 yes. Done with Timber, done with Renoa. Uh, being the leader. Sorry guys. Sorry about all the rants and complaining and all the like salt. But like, oh, oh man. Anyway. There is a slight bit of dialogue here, but yeah. Anyway, this train. Oh, this train bound for East Academy will depart shortly. Oh, and, <laughs> you just feel the train move. Will open, open, open. Make it, please. Oh, well, Selfie wants the. Yeah, she loves the train, so open up. Okay, <laughs> better do as she says. Uh, I, I, <laughs> yes, well, yeah. Yeah, it's just. Uh, how's the bugger up? Yeah, because she likes to enjoy the train, so, as we all know. There you go, Selfie. Confirming access granted. Tee-hee, thanks. <laughs> okay, Selfie. 
enjoy your train ride. She's probably going to go off to sing her little jingle. And uh, oh, let's just talk to everyone here. Um, what's up? We should get going there shortly. We shall. So we'll like be all right out of here. All right, Quizzes. Talk to Renoa. Weren't you just saying something? Um. Uh, let's, um. Uh, which dialogue do I pick here? Oh, uh, there is some funny dialogue we can have here. Um, let's just pick this. Oh, yeah, yeah, I think this is it. I think this is it. We'll, well, we made it. Yeah, true. Like, I can't believe we even successfully boarded this train, but, you know. I have to thank Zone for that. Yeah, yeah, tell me about it, Quistus, yeah. Um... He's in the Naughty Magazine. Why would you just randomly say that, Renoa? It's just like, oh, I have to thank him from that. Yeah, by the way, this guy likes Playboy. What? Renoa. But by the way, this is Renoa's, you know, not-so-subtle way of saying, hey, if you see Zone later in the game, give him that girl next door. That's what this is for, so... Yeah, I mean, that's kind of just a random thing to, blur to blurt out, Renoa, but... Okay, you do you. I'll keep that in mind. Yeah, I feel like, like, Quist is like, what else are you supposed to say to this? Like, what? <laughs> like, like, Renoa, what a random piece of dialogue there, but whatever. Uh, what? What's the matter? I, uh, nothing, nothing. No follow-up to that? We should get going there shortly, so we'll, like, be all right out here. I guess I'll go talk to Selfie. She's probably just singing her usual train thing. Oh, can we go in the cabin? Oh, 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 I guess not this time. Hey, self. I love trains. I love trains. I love every kind of train. Take us away. The sacred place. The thicker place. The great escape. To the future we will go. Where it leads, no one knows. No one knows. I'm going to hang out here for a bit. Okay, self. Yeah, she really does love trains. Yeah, so. See ya. No, no new dialogue from her. She's just kind of in her own little world there. Oh, and everyone, like, I love how when I enter, everyone turns to face me, like, you know. Um, anyway, uh, uh how, what, do we, what do we do here? Oh, I guess we have to, um, um, talk to Zell. Um, let's just, um, leave him alone. Um, hmm. Oh, I wonder what happens if I would have put stay put there. Huh, I don't know. Uh, anyway, kind of weird we had to... <laughs> Yeah, maybe there was a dialogue option if I just stayed put there, but, uh, I don't know. Maybe not. <laughs> anyway. Uh, yes, we want to get off here because this is where the game told us to get off. So, guys, I think we're going to just end the, um, stream right here. Um, yeah, so this time, uh, that's going to be it for this episode of Final Fantasy VIII. Thank you all for joining me. Yeah, a lot of stuff that went down here. Uh, I mean, yeah, so there's the whole, um, yeah, president, you know, failed assassination thing. We saw the sorceress. For the first time and we heard clearly like the game music you know the Elo, you know so that can't be good um yeah also we failed to uh, assassinate to uh, complete the mission and uh, assassinate president delling yeah not looking good not looking good for us and now we're like one and dead or alive i'm a cowboy you know what i mean so yeah now we're wanted you know wanted and anyway yeah, not good. Not, not good. No bueno. So, what's going to happen next time? What's, uh, what shall we do? Um, and um, can we somehow somehow find a way to not only make it to safety, but to, um, yeah, you know, complete the mission and, you know, take out the president? I I don't know. I don't know. But, uh, yeah, guys, that's going to be it for me today. Um, thank you all for joining me, and I'll see you all <laughs> next time. All right. Uh, with that being said, we're going to raid on out. So... Let me raid this person, so. All right. Uh, yep. Have a good day, guys, and I will see you all next time. All right. All right. Ah, nice. So, uh, that pr pretty interesting segment of the game, I must say. But, um, yeah. Uh, what do you guys think will happen next? <laughs> yeah, do you, do, do you? What do you guys think about the plot of this game? Do you think Gold Body of Garden is safe? Do you think that's a good idea? It's just like, you know, like, you know even though we tried to uh, assassinate the president of your country, you know, Gold Body, let's just head to your school. You know, the school that a lot of people go to, you know, even though your public face was shown publicly to the entire world. Yeah, let's just head there. and I'm sure nothing bad will happen, right? If we just show our faces in public, 
you know, at a public school where there's like lots of people. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, this this game doesn't really make sense. You know, if you use like normal logic, you know. <laughs> oh man. Bye. <laughs> oh man. What the hell? Man, hello. <gasps> Thanks for the raid button. How are you? How are you? <laughs> Have the good toilet. Have the good toilet. One second. All right.